openness and magic is um, something I want to talk about today. So very often in magic, we have this idea of creating a character in magic and performance art, but especially magic, right? We want to create this character where we are looking at um, what the audience likes. And we're a bit like monkeys in that. So when, the, when we see something they like, we'll try to do more of that. When we see something they don't like, we try to do less of that. But if we would look at any psychologist or any person that's like looking at life, everyone knows it's a terrible idea to be as other people want you to be. It's a recipe for unhappiness, but especially those people are not authentic. And it's okay to be a different person on stage than you are in person, but, but you still want to be connected to that core. You don't want to be a different person on stage, which is not connected to its own core, to its own values, to its own being. And that is just like a mask showing the audience what they want to see, but maybe not showing them what they necessarily need to see. The thing is, if you're going to hold up that mask and there is no authenticity in that character and no connection to you, then you're not allowing the audience to be open. They're seeing someone that's hiding themselves and a natural response for your audience then is to hide themselves as well, which means that whichever way they're going to react to your magic, it's, it's not as open, not as great as it could be, but it's definitely not going to have the emotional impact it could have. <clears throat> where as if you would be completely open and authentic to your audience they're gonna be open and authentic too it it's feels safe for them it feels nice because they are in front of someone that's open authentic and sharing something beautiful and they're gonna let you genuinely know what they think about that so there's nothing wrong with a, with a character on stage not even with a persona but there are some personas that are very like far disconnected from who you really are. And there are some personas that are very much connected to who you really are. And there are even some people that are just playing like an entire character, but there's still them, right? Um, so that's it for today. Just, just, just see if you can connect to yourself more, your magic, do some grounding maybe. That always really helps me. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video.